Johnson is in the southwest corner of Kansas. We're a smaller community, farming community, about 1,200 people. We're kind of in the middle of absolutely nowhere. It's actually kind of handy to have our own generation system because it comes in need. Some of the industries that we serve are our hospital, uh, local schools, and then we also have a large ag background, so we have our elevators and things like that that we take care of. Skyline Grain is our local elevator. They use a large amount of power for their elevators and grain bins for fan operation, things like that. Our power plant actually started in 1936, and it started out with two generators, and it's gone from there. The system consisted of 1960s technology, and that's been here for the past 50 years, basically. The city of Johnson was at a uh, pivotal uh, turning point. They were looking for options. One of their options was to automate equipment, make it easier so that anybody could run the equipment. So the city of Johnson chose to go with the Tier 4 product uh, with the diesel units in the standby application simply due to the fact that they have an agreement with their utility provider that allows them some cost benefits, some cost paybacks, basically for the opportunity to utilize the Tier 4 credits and that capability in the utilities portfolio. These are CAT C-175, three meg capacity that is used for uh, backup power for the city of Johnson. When we would need to use the generators would be you know, ice storms, if we lose our power, power lines, anything that interrupts the service, that would be when we would need these. The CAT C-175 uh, 3 megawatt tier 4 unit is uh, a very superior piece of equipment. It meets all of the tier 4 emissions regulations from the factory, uh, which gives us a competitive edge and it also allows a size range that the competition currently does not offer. And when we upgraded to our CAT generator system, it was kind of more of a, a jump, I guess, for the city and technology. These generators have made my job so much easier. The time factor has been cut tremendously. It's just so much simpler uh, compared to what I'm used to. I can have power fully restored in town in less than five minutes compared to 25 to 30 minutes on our old system. It's just easy. There's no, no better way to say it. We got like showing everybody. We have a power plant cat that runs around here and we like to tease that it's simple enough that the cat can start it if we're not here. It just takes a matter of a few buttons you touch and we can be online in minutes. It's a benefit for me personally having the new system just because of the, the time of what it takes us to get the system online. I mean, we don't have to babysit it so much. We can kind of bring it up, get it going, and of course, I have other things that I need to take care of then, and we just don't have to sit here and watch it so close. You can monitor it, and it takes less people to do it. Fully Cat has served us really well. We have a, a good relationship with Cliff, which is our salesperson, and also Rick is the technician. He's been excellent. Love working with the guys. We like picking their brains, and they like asking us questions too, and it works well, back and forth. One thing working about cats is, is, is the quality that you're going to get. Everything, you know, down the, the smallest O-ring or the filters and everything are all cat. We work on it. The quality is, is, is really great. And, uh, and the procedures for doing the repairs are there, and it, it, it makes it really easy to do. They've just made this so much easy with the training, just everything. It was a lot smoother than I was expecting it to be. Everybody takes electricity for granted, I guess, and when it's not there, it, it, it's, it's really something that people notice real quick, and when it is there, they don't know the difference, so it, it, it comes in very handy. We're replacing equipment that was 50 years old. Uh, with the cat name, the Foley name, we've been around for 76 years. We will support the city of Johnson uh, for 50 plus years and make sure that this equipment is operational and providing the citizens of Johnson with true clean power.